What's up guys, it's Igor Otenikov here and today we are talking about 7 worst push-up mistakes that killing your chest gains and how to avoid them. Let's start. And we all know that number one exercise to build your chest is push-ups. But you can do push-ups or you can do push-ups that build huge chest. And there is a big difference between these two. And today we are talking about second version that will build huge chest right at your home. Let's start. And before we start guys, I want to say thank you so much for the support. I'm just blown away by your feedback. Thank you for your likes and comments. I appreciate you all so much. And if you're still not subscribed to my channel, please do so right now and hit the notification bell. And let's get started with the seven mistakes. Let's go. So mistake number one, it's you not going full range of motion. And by full range of motion, I mean the following. You start from the top, Go to the bottom, your chest slightly touches the ground, full stretch in your chest, then you blow up and at the top of the movement you squeeze your chest and try to bring your arms together. Touch, blow up, squeeze, touch, blow up, squeeze. If your goal is to build huge chest with your push-ups, this is the only way you can do push-ups. Not half reps, not one of those, not one of those. Your goal with this exercise is simple as stretch chest to the fullest at the bottom of the movement and then blow up and squeeze chest to the fullest at the top of the movement. When you understand this, you understand how to do your push-ups. Mistake number two when it comes to build your chest with the push-ups, it's you're doing it too fast, bro. Slow it down. So guys, my favorite tempo for the push-ups is 4 seconds on the way down and then blow up as fast as you can on the way to the top. 1, 2, 3, 4, blow up and squeeze. By going 4 seconds on the way down, you're making these push-ups a lot harder and you can make sure that you get enough time under tension in your one set of push-ups. And by blowing up on the way to the top, you can activate a lot more muscle fibers in your chest by going to the top in explosive manner. And so another one rep. One, two, three, four. Push-ups mistake number three, it's you're not going to the variation that can make them harder. You start with your standard way of doing push-ups and you're doing them all day. So guys, if your goal is to build chest at home with your push-ups and you already can do four sets of 15 reps with perfect form, four seconds on the way down, chest to the ground, blow up and squeeze at the top, four sets of 15 reps. If you already can do this, guess what? It's time to make them freaking harder. And how you can do it? Let's see. So variation number one, guys. You can elevate your hands. And it will make the push-ups a lot harder already. Then you can elevate your legs. And it will also make the push-ups a lot harder. One, two, three, four. Squeeze. Then you can use them both. One, two, three, four. This is a lot more harder than regular push-ups. And you can do this version for sets of 15 reps, you can go to the next one. If you don't have weights at home, you can go one-handed. So the room for progress is almost unlimited. Just make sure that you make it harder. Mistake number four, you are not adding weight to your push-ups. Because my number one favorite exercise to do at home is weighted push-ups. Let me show you. This is the easiest way to progress and build chest at home because all you need is just backpack and tank of water and you're ready to go. If you apply all the rules that goes for our perfect push-ups, four seconds on the way down, chest to the ground, blow up and squeeze it up and you add backpack on your back, man, you get crazy, crazy hard exercise. That will blow up your chest for sure. One, two, three, four, blow up. One, two, this is crazy hard and crazy effective to build your chest and guess what? You can add more weight to your backpack and then guess what? You can start with our progression but now with the weight. You can add books under your hands and let's freaking go. One, two, three, four, blow up. <laughs> But just make sure when you're using backpack with the weights, it should locate at the top of your back, not at your lower back, but as high as you can. So it will not put a lot of pressure on your lower back and it will not cause 
problems. Just make sure to tight these straps as high as you can and you're ready to go. Mistake number five is breathing and it's especially important when you start working with the weights. You should breathe in on the way down and breathe out on the way up. Just blow up and breathe out everything you have. This is basically your breathing. Put it to the next mistake. Mistake number six is you're not resting enough and you're doing too much push-ups. You're doing too much, man. Because push-ups is so available, you just go to the floor and you can start doing push-ups. It does not mean that you should go on the floor and do them three times per day for 200 reps. If your goal is to maximize chest growth, you should aim for two workouts per week. One workout at Monday and another one at Friday, for example. Go hard with your workouts, but make sure to rest enough so the chest is recovered and ready to go when it's time to give it all to get better. And last one, guys. Mistake number seven with your push-ups is that you don't have a plan for your workouts. Because if you like the consistency, you will lack like the results. So make sure that you have planned your workouts for the next months and stick to this plan. If you're just starting out and you're ready for the challenge, make sure to follow my 28 days free home workout program that you can find on my website, link in the description. Tens of thousands of people already following it and they love the workouts and they love the results. So make sure to check it out, start with day number one, make a photo before and start your transformation today. Thank you so much for watching guys. If you like the video, please give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to check out my crazy challenges like impossible push-ups or push-ups from level 1 to level 80. This video will be right here and also if you're interested in my story, how I got here from being broke and working at McDonald's, check out my story, video will be also right here. Thank you for watching, let's work hard and I will see you in the next video. I'm I'm